Alright guys, so today I'm playing some Sky Wars on Cubecraft. I decided I'd try something new, uh, and, and, you know, stray away from the usual hive, because I was getting kind of bored of it. And speaking of playing, or trying something new, I decided I'd try and tell you guys a story. Because I watched my last video after I uploaded it, and I was like, this is the most boring thing I have ever watched. How did people watch this? Like, how did this even get a single view? It got, like... 11 views. How did this get a single view? It, it was horrible. It actually sucked. And so, I'm gonna try telling you guys a story. Uh, this is not gonna be easy for me because it is insanely difficult for me to talk while I'm playing games. But I figured I would tell you a story about uh, a class that I had at school last year, last school year. Uh, it was an AP class, which if you don't know, means it is basically a college class. Um, okay, I just got one shot. See, so as you guys just saw, it is nearly impossible for me to talk and play the game. I wasn't even thinking when I pushed that guy with, like, three hearts. It's, it's hard for me to play the game. Uh, but anyway, if you don't know what AP class is, it's a college class that you take when you're not in college. And in order to get the college credit, you have to not only pass the class, but pass the test at the end of the year. And... They're, they're, you, they usually give a lot more homework than the normal class. Um, every year before that, I had taken all the, the hardest classes I could. So this year I was like, oh yeah, this is, this class will be a walk in the park. It's not, it's, it won't even be difficult. And I was, I was wrong. It was a fairly difficult class. Um, homework daily. Luckily me and my friend were doing the homework together. So it wasn't it wasn't too bad. It was actually kind of fun. Our teacher was good as well. Um, I can't think. Why are his hearts in his legs? That's not where your heart is, huh? Anyways, as you guys just saw, still cannot play the game and talk. I'll have to get better at that skill. Uh, anyways, I'm sitting here and I'm thinking about stories about this class, and I honestly can't think about any. Uh, it was, it was a pretty difficult class, you know, our teacher was good, it was kind of, it was, it, it was fun being with friends, but basically every single day, we had homework, and a lot of it too, it was like, come home, it was, it was college amounts of homework, I don't know what I was expecting, I, you know, you know, I, I got, they gave me kind of what I should have, what I should have been expecting, but I wasn't expecting that, so it was very difficult for me, um, so anyway, after after the AP exam at the end of the year, the teacher was like, "All right, guys, you guys, you you did it. You passed this class. You guys get a couple weeks of free time now. Um, you guys don't need to worry about you. You guys don't even worry about it anymore." And of course, after suffering for such a long time, we were all super excited. We're like, "Oh, finally, it's it's finally over. We get to just we get to just take a break from life after this class." And then the next day, she immediately was like, "Never mind, that was a that was a joke. Get scammed, kid. You guys have a new a new project that is worth your entire grade." And we were all like, "What? What? I'm just gonna keep." We were all so mad about it. And it was this project where we had to make our dream vacation based on all of the stuff we learned over the years. Over the year, I guess. So we had to use, we had to say, oh, we want to go to this place because it has all of this and it has a high whatever HDI and a whole bunch of stuff that honestly I couldn't explain to you anymore because it's been what has felt like years since this class finished. Um, and so me and my friends were like, huh, we don't want to do this project. This project sucks. We thought we were done for the year. And so, instead of being like everybody else and doing what we were supposed to do, me and my friends decided to go to Galaxy GNZ11. Sorry guys, this gameplay probably isn't even very fun to watch because of how much I'm losing. I, I can't even get a single kill for some reason. Anyway, we decided to go to Galaxy GNZ11, the furthest galaxy away from Earth. And we made up a whole, a whole storyline about how... Ben Shapiro was the aliens' gods, and they were going through racial cleansing and whole bunch of stuff. We, I, when I, when I'm saying, when I tell you that we made a whole story, I mean that we made a whole story. We were not just presenters; we were entertainers. 
and we were just having fun we were like no we don't want to do this project we we got told that this was that we were done for the year but this project this slideshow that we made was honestly so good i'm like by the end of it we actually looked back at it and we were like holy crap we did an amazing job um it perfectly related to everything she wanted it, it to relate to it talked about you know ethnic cleansing and like i said and and uh apartheid and and just everything that she could have asked for really um how did i just get hit what anyway uh and so it was surprisingly good we won for the best class uh presentation our teacher said that it was the best one she had ever seen uh it was it was you know best thing ever created honestly I... get out of here with your eggs get out of here i have a trident trident are actually broken so this this presentation it was it was really a joke we were not being very serious we made up like the glorpians and and the schmibbledy dibbly was the dance of the the glorpians and we made up a couple other planets that we went to we made it like an episode of rick and morty that's that's really what our goal was was to make it seem like they were we were just reading a, a an episode of rick and morty to them and we not only achieved that but you know we achieved we achieved the great which was the most important part uh how am i gonna get over to this guy I don't, I don't think these hay bales are enough. Oh, I have another chest. Um, I don't even remember what I was saying. I got sidetracked. No. I didn't, my arrow, it didn't shoot, huh? Oh my gosh, I barely won that fight. I definitely, that is, oh baby. Okay. So, I don't really know what else to say about it. You know, I really gave you guys the whole rundown of the, of the presentation. Um, I don't know. This is, this is my first time trying to tell a story. Subscribe. I'm getting, I'm, huh? Editor Shubo here. Uh, if you, if I get 10 subscribers off this video, I, I'll post the, the slideshow so that you guys can see it. Alright, bye. Alright guys, thank you for watching this video, um, I hope, I hope I did a, an okay job at telling a story, it was, it's pretty difficult for me to, to talk while I'm playing games, but, uh, subscribe!